What? That's gonna kill him, isn't it? Oh, you know what? It might. <gasps> Crap, my bad. No! <laughs> no, me! I don't want to live on this world anymore! <laughs> you jerk! <laughs> I bet. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I'm so sad right now. I hate you. You're sad. I used one of my name tags. <laughs> Another sunset. On sleepless night server. Peaceful. Horse pen's gone. Got a lot more lighting up to do. What's everybody? This is Bass Player KG, back with another episode, as I said, on the Sleepless Night server. Should fall damage. And today, uh, today we're going back into the nether. Uh, I've done a lot more work in there and getting some more, uh, getting some more supplies and such. You will see when we get in there. Uh, so we're just going to work. We're going to work in there. We're going to get, um, we're gonna try and get as much as we can done in there. Uh, here we go. Boom. Bam. Look at this. All this digging out, getting it to the right specifications. Dug all the way out, and then dug this out, and dug the pattern for the floor out. Yeah. It's a lot of, uh,. A lot of stuff. That gas. I gotta find out where this gas is. Um, but yeah, so I got all this. I got all this dug out. It honestly, it didn't take me too long um, once I switched to my mining pick because um, it's efficiency four. But now it's done, and I've decided I'm going to keep the pumpkins. I'm gonna keep them facing this way, and that's fine with me. And then up top here. Up top. Oh man, I gotta dig out more of this. But uh, you know what? Let's let's go ahead and let's empty our inventory of all of our all of our supplies here. Uh, nope, keep that. This. So I've decided that. Let's see if I can. Now, well, I, I've decided that I'm going to use spruce wood for the for the ceiling here. And I don't think I'm going to do anything fancy with it. I think I'm just going to leave it block, you know, like this. Um, I like I like the color of it, you know, that goes with all the goes with the you know the purple of the nether rack and then the this whitish cream color. With the smooth sandstone, and then you know the the stone brick. I like this a lot better. And then inside, you know, every once in a while, we're gonna do. Um, actually, pro mm, I, well, I'll probably put redstone lamps up here instead of pumpkins. Um, yeah, that's what we'll probably do. I don't need them, but I just want the look. Um, so yeah. That's what I'm gonna be doing up there, but this I'm not gonna worry about right now. I'm not gonna worry about the. Uh, I'm not gonna worry about this, and I'm going to be turning this down because. Ugh, it's annoying. All right. So let's get started. I'm gonna get rid of some of the stuff that we won't need. Oops. Yeah, that could stay there. Whatever. So this is probably all we're gonna need. And phone going off. Let's, let's take care of that. No. Sorry about that. Totally unprofessional. There we go. Silenced. Alright, so we'll take our smooth stone bricks and we're gonna start off with that. We're just gonna We're gonna go straight out here. So yeah, this is I'm hoping I can get this done fairly quickly because this isn't a necessary project, 
This is something that I just want to, uh, those pigmen just spawned in right there, wow. Um, it's just something that I wanted to, wanted to do, wanted to get done, and I knew I should have grabbed some more. So, just to pretty this up, and of course this one, like, I, I don't know just, what Justin's going to do with his, because it's going to take him a long time to be able to get that done, and... Honestly, I don't know if he's if he would ever be able to get it done. Cause like I said, that's that's a lot. Can you can can you move, sir? Sir, sir, sir. Sir sir. Sir oh I'm in your way, sorry, okay. Yeah, I don't know what he's gonna do. And you walk right out of one and you go right into the next one. There's nothing there for you. You can't go in there. Did I miss this one? Hmm. God, I hope I don't hit them because I don't have any armor and I don't have my sword. So it'd be really bad if I did decide to hit one. Or I hit one on accident. I don't really. I don't know why I decide to hit one on purpose. And this little guy. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, leave. Thank you. Leave, we won. I guess that pro provides enough light. I may not have to do ceiling lights. I may not have to. This looks, this looks bright enough, and it's happy. Jack o' lanterns make it look happy. Oh man. Um. You know, what? I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna kind of talk about real life stuff. Uh, Cause this is just gonna be boring, tedious. Oh no. I'm gonna need more pumpkins. Um. I don't know. I don't know how many people are actually paying attention, um, like sports and that. Uh, I, I, I like I like sports. Um, baseball is my favorite. I, um, even though I live in Florida, uh, born and raised in Florida, um, ever since probably around. I think it's been around since 2006 or so. Um, I've become a Dodger fan, so I've been a Dodger fan for you know about seven years now, and they're in the playoffs. And it's not just you know well they're you know the Dodgers have been around forever. Um, you know they're a pretty prestigious team. You know it's not it's not about that for me. It's about being you know being a fan, and I've been a fan. I can you know I can tell you some of the people that we've you know some of the people that we've lost some of the people that we've traded away the people that we've gained you know I mean it's I, I don't I don't know all the deep history you know I know <clears throat> I know some of the troubles that they you know that they had in the oh, little guy in the overworld um, that they had in one of their world series and um, why they why they left New York and that um, I mean here here in Florida we've got uh, two, two MLB teams, and one of them is, one of them is the Tampa Bay Rays, and the other one is, uh, it's the Miami Marlins, and I don't, I actually live way close at Render, much? Nope, spider coming after me and I don't have any weapons. Um, I live, uh, the Rays play in St. Petersburg. Spider's gonna chase right after me. Um, they play in St. Petersburg. But they're the Tampa Bay Rays. Don't, don't ask me why. People, people got mad. And, you know, cause it's, whatever. There's a whole stupid, stupid thing. But, um, but yeah, I'm, I mean, I guess as, as an American League team, 
you know, in a hometown team, yeah, I'm 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 a Rays fan. Um, but the Dodgers, the Dodgers are my team, and they're in the playoffs right now. They're playing. Um, they're actually going to Game Six with against uh, the Cardinals. Um, they're heading back to St. Louis. Um, it's been a little rocky. We've 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 had kind of we had a rough season. Um, beginning of the year, uh, we were we were plagued with injuries, and um, e even though we have the payroll, you know we've just we've been we've been marred by injuries. And it sucks because you know we've got some really you know really good guys and uh, through trades and you know bringing them up through the farm systems, um, but we just uh, uh, people I mean people were get and people get injured you know stuff happens it's baseball or with any sport really, um, so but we've 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 you know we've fought we fought back we came back we were actually. Um, we finished first in our division, which in in the West, I don't know West. That's not a you know. Well, it's a lot harder than it used to be. The West was considered a soft division, but now you've got um, you've got San Francisco, who you know has uh, really pushed in a couple World Series now recently. Um, and then you have uh, the Diamondbacks, who really they've—I mean—they've fought to, you know, to be better. And the Rockies, the Rockies are usually always strong, and you know they continue to get strong. So it's not really, you know, it's it's not no, not nearly as a soft division as it used to be. Um, it's definitely more competitive. But there, uh, we've. We've had um, we've had some some great success, and we're in the playoffs. So I'm I'm hoping for two more wins, uh, so that we can go to the World Series. Cause uh, I, I think these guys with as with as much with as much stuff as they've as they've had to go through, um, you know, just with with all the the injuries and of course the ownership. Uh, the past few years wasn't that great, but now um, Magic Johnson and company—they've—they've um, they've done a great job at riding the ship and bringing an influx of money in, so that we can have a competitive team. So yeah, that's been sports talk with baseball Gagey. Um, so if you guys want, you know, I'd love—I'd love for you guys to let me know. Like this is probably one of the only times that I'll, you know. I'll ask you. Well, no, I, I've asked you. That's that's for something else. Never mind. Um, I want I want to know what you guys' favorite teams are and why. Um, you know, if it's not if it's not baseball, if it's you know if it's soccer, I know a little bit about soccer. I'm not you know, I'm not as efficient as as some people, but I know some teams. Um, I don't necessarily know players, but I know some teams. What did I do wrong? Oh, I put those far too far back. Oh, well, I'll fix that later. Oh wait, no. Yes, I did. Dang it! I'm gonna fix that now. That's gonna bother me. Um, but yeah, let me let me know what you got. You know what what everybody's favorite you know teams are, whether it be baseball, basketball, football. Um, actually, all of these are gonna have to be changed. I'm gonna have to go back and do that off camera. Um, cause I'm. I, I mean, I like I like most most all sports. I can I can watch soccer. Um, I can watch football. I played fantasy football. I actually played uh, fantasy baseball, but this year I decided that I was going to kind of take a break from it. And um, I've actually been able to you know to en enjoy the season as a fan than you know having to keep up daily with a. Uh, with a fantasy baseball roster. But yeah, I will watch I'll watch almost any uh any sports. Um football's football's on, obviously. Um I've I've been interested to see, you know, with everything with everything that's uh everything that's gone on, you know, the league is 
the league has been shaken up by you know by a lot of stuff with all the with all the changes the changes they've been making for you know for the players safety and um, rules against late hits which is a part of the player safety thing but you know there's there's been a lot of stuff that's you know that's that's changed for football and you know a lot of people are you know even the some of the ex the ex players or former players, you know, some of the greats are even saying that some of these, some of these decisions that, you know, that the NFL is making, some of them, yeah, some of them are good, but some of them are just complete, you know, complete nonsense. And, you know, they played the game, they know. So I wouldn't, you know, I, I wouldn't argue with them. Um, I don't necessarily like Goodell either, because I think he's, he's kind of pompous, but. Yeah, I'm 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 excited. Like the the Seahawks have been phenomenal this year. Um, of course, everybody saw at the end of last year that that they were going to be you know a team to be reckoned with. Um, and then you look at like the the Giants, who I if I remember right, they're zero and four or something like that. I don't know what's going on over there. Maybe they... I don't know. I, I can't even speculate. But... And you've got, like, the the Colts who are, you know, doing a pretty decent job. You know, they're not... They're not great. And then, of course, Denver... Peyton Manning pulling out... Some stellar games. You know, people... People give him a lot of flack, but... He's, a uh, He's a he's a good quarterback. He knows you know he knows the game. He's been playing for long enough. Um, he's not exactly everybody's favorite quarterback, but I'm out of smooth sandstone now. Well, dang it! Well, I'll do some more stuff here. Um, but yeah, he's he's not he's not everybody's everybody's favorite quarterback. But there are there are a lot of people that you know that like him. Um, I don't, I mean, I don't, I don't mind him, he's, you know, he, he's not, he's not, I don't know, he's not your prototypical pretty boy, you know, um, hmm, what am I going to do here, yeah, we'll do that, boop, 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 boop. Um, he's not your, you know, your flashy, pretty boy quarterback, you know, like Tom Brady or, you know, Cam Newton. But he's got, you know, he's got a great attitude, and a lot of, a lot of that has come from his, you know, come from his dad, uh, Archie Manning. Him and, him and Eli both, man, they've... They've had uh, trying to think and do this stuff. Um, they've had probably one of one of the you know better upcomings because you know you've got a your you know your dad is a you know was a great quarterback, and then you know and then you come in and. You know, you show yourself as a as a dominant quarterback, and then your little brother comes in and he shows himself as a dominant quarterback. You know, there's not a whole lot of uh, not a whole lot of players that can say, you know, they're they're the son of a great or something like that. You know, I mean, I don't know. I'm just rambling at this point. But yeah, let me know. Let me know what your, you know, what your team is. You know, where you live. If your hometown team is your team, or if you're, you know, you're rooting for a team that maybe, you know, maybe your your family roots for them because that's their hometown, not necessarily yours, but it's a family thing. Or if you don't even like sports, 
you know, let me know. I mean, everybody's everybody's got something they like. Even heck, we'll even go into esports because esports, man, those guys make bank. Um, the the you know, I, I'll I'll watch the Call of Duty, uh, the Call of Duty esports stuff, and League of Legends because I I play League of Legends. Um, I watch I watch some of the some of the championships, man, and it's insane. These you know. These guys, a lot of it, you know. I mean, there is some, there is some skill to it, but you know, the knowledge of the game, you've got to, you know, you got to have the knowledge of the game. You've got to, um, you know, they they practice anywhere between, you know, 12 to 14 hours a day, and then some of them, you know, some of them go through and they stream. You know, it's, I mean, it's it's ridiculous the the amount of work that these guys, you know put into it because they love the game you know you look at look at minecraft you know there's there's people all over the community that have made minecraft a you know uh, a job because they you know they enjoy it and they, and they enjoy um, you know they enjoy giving you know giving people entertainment something to watch something you know something that's not necessarily the the stuff that you see every day on you know on television or whatever because you can't you can't get stuff like well I mean you can't I can't say you really can't but um, there's some stuff that you just can't you, you can't see on regular TV that you know people on YouTube I don't want to say get away with, but you know it's it's a lot easier to put some stuff on YouTube than it is on television. <clears throat> even though sometimes it doesn't even doesn't even feel like it. So this place is looking. I mean, look at we're not even done yet. Like I'm I've just gone through and just in the you know short time that I've been recording, man. Look at this. I mean, it's already looking way better. You don't see all the crappy netherrack on the walls and ah, this is this is good, this is good. It's not gonna take me very long. What I'll probably do is I'll probably just finish uh finish it up on camera. Um like the the some of the main stuff 'cause I've got I've got a lot of a lot more work to do. I've got to get more um I actually gotta get more nether brick. I need more nether brick. I've got to. I've got to farm more spruce wood. And luckily, I've got. I've got a bunch of different. You know, I've got basically I have all four trees around me, so I can. Um, I can get that stuff pretty easily. Spruce is. Spruce isn't an easily farmed tree in my opinion um, I found that it's not as you know it's, it's not as easily farmed as you know as oak or birch or the jungle trees jungle trees man you just grow those things in a two by two and you, know, you get over a stack and a half sometimes two stacks so but yeah, I'm probably I'm probably just gonna I'm gonna finish this off, uh, finish it, oh, ha, ha, ha. finish this. There we go, off camera, and or at least the stuff that stuff that I can do with the materials that I have, and then we'll come back through and detail it a little bit. Um, obviously, I have to fix the the pumpkin lamps and that, but I'm I need a lot of nether brick. Um, I'm probably just gonna have to smelt down a bunch of uh, nether rack. Finish off the rest of this stack. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna need a lot more nether brick because I still have I still have to line the tops of these. And then, whoops, double slab. There we go. But yeah, I got to do the stripe on the top, and 
um, for the fences for the pumpkin or in front of the pumpkins. And then, um, yeah. So I got a lot more to do. Uh, I'm gonna, obviously I'm going to be doing this all off camera, and this is the this will probably be the last episode for the week. I don't know. I haven't really decided yet. I may do something for this weekend. Um, I wouldn't hold your breath though. <laughs> just uh, just a warning. I may I may put something out there. Keep an eye out for it. Um, uh, and then I'll obviously be um, Justin and Adrian's. Uh, channel links are always in the description so go watch their stuff you know adrian adrian's doing a lot of you know a lot of different series as well as uh as well as justin is and you know they've got they've got a lot of stuff already and uh it's actually some of them you know some of it like adrian's stuff is is funny just because he's he's a random guy he always just does a random you know random random videos or you know how he reacts to stuff, and Justin. Justin's playing Kingdom Hearts, and he's he's never played it before, and he gets frustrated in some spots. So, that's well, I find that amusing. So, uh, but yeah, go check them out. And um, yeah, this is this is looking this is looking good. We're gonna gonna make this the oops, wrong one. Boom. There we go. It's gonna be the thumbnail. Uh, we're gonna go to the overworld. No, we're not. We're gonna end it here because I gotta get my stuff out of the chest and that. So, all right. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, like I said, leave a comment. Let me know what your favorite sports team is. Where you, you know, where where you live city-wise. Um, yeah, just let me know who your, you know, who your favorite sports team is, or if you just like any of the sports in general. Uh, Esports included. We're gonna include that. And uh, Minecraft will be an eSport one day. Maybe. Knock on Obsidian. Alright. Uh, <laughs> thanks for watching, guys. And uh, have a good day, evening, and afternoon. And I'll talk to you guys later.